All right, we are packed up, loaded up, ready to go for today's adventure. It's gonna be a hot one today. 90, 91 degrees, but we're heading up to Blue Ridge Parkway. Going to park at um, the Peaks of Otter Visitor Center and head north for, I don't know, 25, 30 miles and then drop off of the parkway on the east side and head down around the Lynchburg Reservoir and then come up and go across the parkway and head to the west side down into Buena Vista and a bunch of the back roads in the Jefferson National Forest. So come along for the adventure. Um, the parkway uh, off the parkway down to the Lynchburg Reservoir couldn't get in there made it back up to the top of the mountain sitting at the Blue Ridge Parkway right now um, I'll show that behind me going under parkway and heading down the other side of the mountain to Buena Vista Coming into Glasgow here. This is where the James goes through the mountain. Balcony Falls is that way towards Jane, um, towards Lynchburg. Up this way is towards um, I don't know Buchanan, I guess. Actually, this is the Mori. The Mori is heading down to meet up with the James right down there. And the James comes along the mountain range and then cuts through into Balcony Falls. So, so I've got my rivers mixed, mixed up here. Anyway, um, look at that. I was riding up on top of that and then on the other side of it, down towards Lynchburg. Um, Reservoir, which we couldn't get into. And now, trying to find some lunch. It's supposed to be a good fishing river here.
right, just finishing lunch up at the Pink Cadillac Diner. Heading over to uh, Great Valley Brewery next and uh, get a beer or two and then start heading, heading home from there. So far been a wild and good day.
we'll be okay as long as I can get this scooter started again. It's a little iffy to turn it off out here in the middle of nowhere. Let's get my GPS plugged back in. Get my phone plugged back in. Turn the power on. Hopefully you can get this thing started. Yeah, I believe I was recording. Was I or was I not? Can't remember. Now, please start. Eighty percent of your braking power comes from your front brake, which I don't have. I gotta be careful. Love these roads, though. This is exactly what I was looking for. Like farm roads, like up and down in the mountain. Another thing is that with a motorcycle and gears, you can gear down and put it down in the second, even first gear if you need to slow it down. You can't do that on a variable. What these are called transactional variable speed transmission. So that. It's to the honey hole. Foot welcome. Foot trail welcome. Road close to all public motor use. Well, that sucks. Well, I'm not going to go through there. Even though I know that's a shortcut. I could probably walk under that. Oh well. Not gonna do it. The hell was that? That's why Garmin wouldn't let me go through there, but Google Maps said I could.
or a free camp. Checking this out. Beautiful uh, camp spots here. Let's see if there's camp post. Nice. I think I saw two, two campers. Let's go check out the other one. Before we get dark, this goes up to the honey hole. I would say the honey hole is this area, not really the pond. I would say this is it. I can't go in here. Never get back up there. I don't see water on there. All right. Make sure to give it a try. Honey hole. So this is the infamous honey hole. I would say is this still recording? Maybe they 
mean, that's where the bees come. This road just sort of stops here. So I think this must be it. The honey hole. That's strange. I think we'll walk through there. Looks like there's a path right through here. I would say that this is probably... I'm going to get ticks all over me here. Hmm. Looks like there could be a stream down there. Could drive through there. I hole might be over there somewhere. Down down in there. Let's just go look over here for a minute. So on Google Maps at the end of this road <laughs> it's funny. This area, this thing is called the honey hole. And you got to get all the way back here. To check it out. So let's go down in here. Looks like a dry stream bed. bed. Well, there is a path right here. This might be the AT. I don't know. Let's go down this path. Uh, I think there was a trail listed on the maps. I got spiders, spiders crawling on me. All right. Jokes on me. Now, for all of you that always wondered, and you want to find this on Google Maps, now you know what the honey hole is. It's just an opening in the woods bunch of weeds. Looks like there was a road that used to go through there. My life opening planted in food for wildlife. All right. hill to find the infamous honey hill honey hole and it was just a big open spot planned for wildlife in the woods I assume it now means honey hole for deer or something but now I gotta head out of here I think it's about two miles or so back to this spot 
from the main, from <laughs> not even the main road, um, from the road. This is a dead end gravel road called Gravel Road. Anyway, I'll keep going. showing up on top of flat top and sharp top. There we go. That is sharp top right up there. Flat top up here. Finish up a day. Some riders right there. Anyway, I keep saying anyway, good day, good ride, got about an hour ride home, so hopefully maybe I can get it home right before dark, have another beer when I get there. <laughs>